on 3 February 2016. An avalanche hit an Indian military base in northern Siachen Glacier region, trapping 10 soldiers under deep snow. Background Avalanche 10 soldiers were buried under snow after their camp in the northern part of the Siachen Glacier was hit by a major avalanche. Rescue operations by specialized teams of the Army and the Air Force were underway and coordinated from Leonudamper. The incident highlights the extreme risks that soldiers face in manning the inhospitable terrain at heights of 21.000 feet under extreme weather conditions on the world. S. Highest Battlefield Over the years, India has invested heavily in procuring high-quality equipment. The Army has streamlined procedures for better climatization, and this has helped to cut casualties. However, all that is no guarantee against the avalanche of the sort that hit the camp. More soldiers have been killed in the Siachen Glacier owing to weather than by enemy fire over the years. Over 870 soldiers have lost their lives due to climatic conditions and environmental factors since. The Army launched Operation Meghdud in 1984, preempting Pakistan's attempt to occupy the strategic heights. The guns fell silent after India and Pakistan declared a ceasefire along the line of control actual ground position line in November 2003. Rescue Operation Lance Nae Kahneman Thapakapad, an Indian soldier with a 19th Battalion of the Madras Regiment of the Indian Army, survived the massive avalanche and was found during post-disaster avalanche rescue operations by the Indian Army. Six days after the disaster, he was rescued from 35 feet beneath the snow in minus 45 sea temperatures. Six days after an avalanche hit an Indian Army post in Siachen, at an altitude of 19, 600 feet, his health was critical, but survival news gave family members a chance to celebrate. Nine other personnel at the post, including a junior commissioned officer, JCO, of Madras Regiment, died in the incident. His family's and the country's celebration was short-lived as he eventually died at the military hospital in New Delhi due to multiple organ failure. Hanuman Thapa died on the 11th of February 2016 at 11. 45 hours before his death, social media websites were filled with news that Hanuman Thapa had been rescued. This invited reactions from all over the country. Indian news channels were flooded with reports depicting the bravery of the soldier. During Hanuman Thapa's treatment, Prime Minister Narendra Modi visited him at the hospital. Several political parties and politicians themselves praised the soldier's will that in spite of all odds, he did not lose hope and was finally rescued.